Welcome back to Andrew Jean Cleaning. Today we're going to be using the Miracle Shower Cleaner to clean out this garbage can. Y'all, this is disgusting. Like, I'm embarrassed to show you this. I want to blame it on the previous owners of this house. But then that goes to show that we have not cleaned it in two years before purchasing this house. So it smells like death in here. You can see we put baking soda in there and it has helped temporarily, but oh man, it's bad. So let's get down to business, show you what we're working with here. And then I'm going to speed everything up as we clean this out. I mean, it's, it's bad. Look at this. Look at it. So disgusting. <laughs> So I also have a video. I use the Miracle Shower Cleaner in my shower. Um, so I will have that link below as well. So here I have it mixed up. I'm gonna use this around the edge to spray the garbage can. So we got some Dawn, we got some cleaning vinegar, and I just got a bucket. And this contraption here is really gonna help us clean the inside of the garbage can without having to dive into the garbage can. <laughs> I will have this link below as well. Some gloves here, these are old ones, and I got these from the Dollar Tree, which I absolutely love. And then we got this green little scrubby here. As far as what we're gonna do, I'm gonna spray this down with water, get it nice and wet. And then I'm going to, I'll just mix this for you here now so you can see what I'm gonna do. I am not measuring anything out. We're just going to eyeball things. We're going to be very generous with our pour here. Again, they call this the miracle shower method. And it works mostly well. Um, doesn't work on nickel fixtures, I'll tell you that much. And I like cleaning vinegar because it is slightly more acidic than regular vinegar, but you can use whatever you got. And then I will fill that up probably with a little bit more water. Again, no rhyme or reason for the amount here, but let's get down to business, speed this up, and let's see if we can get this bad boy less stinking and looking like new. So I went ahead and dumped out the excess water and then I just filled this up with some water and we're gonna go ahead, dump that in here and start scrubbing away. I'm gonna take my spray bottle and then squirt along the sides here as well. Before we take a peek at the garbage can after just one scrub down, I just want to show you a couple things. So there was some stickers or wrappers or whatnot stuck in the bottom of the garbage can. So I ended up taking this shovel here to get it out so that I could really get in there. Well, these gloves are going to get tossed. This is really nice because this comes off and you can dispose of it. Um, and then I will disinfect and sanitize the rest of this. Um, but yeah, let's go take a peek here. one coat and you all there's a kink in my hose so the water pressure was not very good but look at that so much better now there is still some stuff and gunk down in there um, and if i really wanted to get crazy about this i could go over it again with a whole new scrubbing pad just use my spray bottle and do some final squirts on this to get all this stuff up here um, but i'm not going to do that the smell is gone the smell is gone and that's why vinegar is so nice and the dawn is really really nice too and the combination is just perfect because dawn is a degreaser so look at that that's just one coat so like i said i could go in there again and get all of this out here 
but it's looking so much better. We have some water pooling down here, so I'll go ahead and dump this again, and then I will just let it, keep it outside and let it air dry, but I would definitely recommend the Miracle Shower Cleaner if you have some heavy-duty projects such as an outdoor garbage can like this one right here. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and also hit me up on Instagram, Andrew Jean Co. I teach women how to turn their passions into profits, and so yeah, thank you for being here. Yay!